Welcome back everyone, Chag Sameach. I'm really, really sad that we can't meet in person right now because one of my favorite traditions and one of my favorite things about being Jewish is during Simchat Torah, where we all come to synagogue and we all dance with each other and with the Torahs. So I'm really sad that I can't do that this year, but I'm really looking forward to when I get to see you next year. But for now, we're gonna make our very own Torahs. So the last project that I hope you did first, and if not, go ahead and go back and watch that one because that part needs to come first was when we were practicing being our own sofers, right? The people who read the Torah, we were practicing writing with a quill. So this is mine. So I'm gonna put that over here because that is gonna be the inside of your Torah. And I want you to take your two paper towel rolls and you're gonna glue them one on each side so they stick to the paper. All right, so once you guys have that all glued together, you can go ahead and set that to the side. And now we're gonna start making our Torah covers. So with this, you can pretty much do it however you want to. I'm gonna use colored pencils. I think markers might be easier. But as far as decorating goes, anything you want. I mean, make sure to keep it Jewish. You can draw a Star of David. Like that, color it in a little bit. I'm gonna draw an olive branch. That signifies peace, right? All right, so here's my finished Torah cover, but I love the Torah covers that have a little bit of fringe at the bottom. So I think I'm gonna add that to mine. And I'm just gonna take a pair of scissors and go in about half an inch and make small little cuts. So here's my finished Torah cover, and I'm sure all of yours look amazing. I can't wait to see them. So next you're gonna take your Torah that you put together and you're gonna roll it up. And then you're gonna take your Torah cover and put it over it and wrap it around. And it's okay if it's a little bit big. And then you wanna take a ribbon or a piece of string or whatever you have and slide it underneath. This part gets a little bit hard. And then you wanna tie it. And here you guys have your very own homemade Torahs. And you can unroll it Take off the cover, just like what you would do with a real Torah. Bye guys.